now at 5.30, the Broward Public Defender's Office claiming there is bias on the bench in one judge's courtroom. We're talking about Judge Elizabeth Shearer, who oversaw the MSD killer's trial and sentencing. The public defender says she showed obvious animosity towards him and his attorneys, and now they are taking drastic action. Local Tennessee Andrew Perez explains. The Broward Public Defender's Office wants Judge Elizabeth Scherer far away from all its cases, filing motions in more than 130 of them so far, claiming she can't be fair ever since the Parkland shooter trial. Our clients may have concern as to whether the court is going to be impartial, and we as their attorneys have a legal obligation to raise that issue and preserve it. Public Defender Gordon Week says the mass shooting trial was brutal on so many levels. The temperature was hot, he says, even by the judge, especially during sentencing, when he believes his own attorneys almost became like a public enemy number one. I saw a building of anger and I saw that being directed largely to the work that the attorneys were compelled to do. You if are you being want... disrespectful. You know what? I, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Judge, you're insulting me on the record. This follows years of tough talk and back and forth with the judge, including this exchange, when they felt that Judge Scherer was allowing hateful speech on the stand directed at them personally. You're out of line. In fact, you're excused. Sit down, Mr. Weeks. Please do not summarily dismiss me. I'm summarily dismissing I'm asking you. Go for sit it. down. Then there was the hug with prosecutors. Weeks says his office has gotten so much hate since. You dumb Sure hope you get cancer and die. I hope your children are a victim of the next school shooter. Violent voicemails and threats, most too graphic for TV. He says what happened in court only helped fan those flames. The court should have had a much stronger control of the courtroom, recognizing that there was going to be a lot of pain. So the public defender's office is reaching out to all of its clients to let them know to see what they want to do. I should point out we have reached out to the chief judge for comment, but all along throughout this entire process, Judge Scherer has been saying she's only following the law. As the latest here in Fort Lauderdale, I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News. All right, Andrew, very controversial indeed.